Pericardial fat can behave both as brown and white adipose tissue in different situations. In healthy persons, epicardial fat behaves like brown adipose tissue and utilizes fatty acids, preventing local pro-inflammatory action and providing nutrition to adjacent tissue. On the other hand, in obesity, it functions like white adipose tissue which causes lipolysis and release of fatty acids which are pro-inflammatory. In mouse models, it has been shown that thoracic perivascular adipose tissue is resistant to diet-induced macrophage infiltration and may protect the vascular bed from inflammatory stress. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Click on the subscribe button, press the bell icon after that for all updates. In addition, epicardium is an important source of mesenchymal stem cells which may contribute to cardiac regeneration. When the oxidative stress is low, epicardial adipocytes secrete adiponectin. Adiponectin minimizes cardiomyocyte hypertrophy and inflammation as well as fibrosis in coronary arteries and myocardium, thereby reducing the chance of adverse events. Local and systemic concentrations of adiponectin have been inversely correlated to the presence of coronary artery disease. This suggests anti-atherogenic effect of adiponectin. This study was conducted using serum and adipose tissue samples collected from pericoronary depots in patients undergoing CABG and patients without coronary artery disease undergoing aortic wall replacement. Adipokine synthesis pattern of epicardial fat changes in obesity and dyslipidemia. Adiponectin synthesis comes down and pro-inflammatory adipokines like leptin, tumor necrosis alpha, interleukin 1 beta, interleukin 6 and resistin get synthesized. These cause macrophage infiltration, destruction of microvasculature and increase in fibrosis. In one study, Abdominal and epicardial fat tissue samples were obtained from those with CAD undergoing CABG and from those without CAD undergoing other types of open heart surgery. Tissue levels of tumor necrosis factor alpha, interleukin 6 and leptin were significantly higher in those with CAD. Here are some important references on the roles of pericardial fat. Remaining references on different roles of pericardial fat are here. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for future updates and click on the bell icon for all updates. Thank you.